Hey, what's going on gamers? It's me, Matt, here, and today we're gonna be looking at the uh, 3.4 special program released by Genshin Impact. I've already watched this, and I gotta say, I'm very excited for 3.4. There's one thing that I'm targeting, and I'm gonna be talking about it later, but first off, there's gonna be a new story quest, or story quest? Was it story? Yeah, it is story quest. It is Alhatham's story quest. I can't quite understand if it's if it's uh, an Archon quest or a story quest, but I, it is, I think it's a story quest. So there's two new characters that are coming out in 3.4, and that is, where is she? Yep, Yao Yao and I'll hate them. And I gotta say, I'll hate them looks fucking sick. Like, look at this, dude. Look at that attack. Oh my god. It's sad that I'm not gonna be pulling for him on my main account, but, 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 I am pulling for him on my alt account. So yeah, I'll hate them and Yao Yao is coming. Both Dendro units, Yao Yao being a 4 star and I'll hate them being a 5 star. 3.4 banners, it looks like it's going to be fucking insane, alright? All of the characters from phase 1 and phase 2 are great fucking characters, like, Utao and Yelan and Alhatham and Zhao. Alhatham is very cool. He looks like he's gonna be like a, a Dendro Keqing. So, you know, we're gonna have another Dendro unit that is a good Dendro applicator. So I'm excited for that. And Zhao is a very good AoE damage dealer because, you know, plunging attack is his main uh, DPS type. And then we have Hu Tao and Yelan who's getting a rerun also. And, you know, Hu Tao is my favorite character in the game. I have her at C1 and my plan is getting her, her weapon Staff of Homa on my main account. And it looks like Yelan's also getting, uh, getting paired up with her. 3.4 weapon banners might be one of the best best weapon banners in the game if the four stars are good the banners might be fucking broken like oh my god i can't wait i can't wait also because it's lantern right we are going to get 10 free wishes when logging in and also they decided to give out three more wishes intertwined fates i mean when logging into the game so yeah they decided to do that and it's fucking awesome also coming in 3.4 is a new area which I am so fucking excited, bro. Like, oh my god. Also, there's gonna be new enemies like this. New, oh my god, this new boss looks fucking insane. Look at this. The boss comes from underground. And I think it does anim animal uh, element. It has animal element. Yep, it does. Yeah, there it is. <laughs> oh my god, just look at that. Fuck, dude. And then, yeah, there's gonna be these enemies that are roaming around in the desert. They look sick, even the- Oh, mama. Mama. <laughs> <laughs> mommy? Is that you, mommy? Mommy? <laughs> okay, I, 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 I gotta stop. I gotta stop, bro. If that is open world, that is going to be sick. That is going to be beautiful. Uh, I'm, I'm hoping it is, but... There's there's a part in my ma mind that I think it's not and it's going to be the part Oh, yeah, the part of the world quest that is also gonna be out once 3.4 drops But in order for this world quest to, to be started you need to finish I think what was it golden slumber where you have to find jet Yeah, where you have to uh, fight with jet and then go into the uh, like the pyramid stuff Okay, so 3.4 uh, update is going to be Lantern, right? So yeah, there's going to be a lot of events that are uh, for uh, Lantern, right themed. And one of them is this. It's the paper thingy, paper event. I don't know what it's called, but yeah. It's basically, yeah, you need to make this guy go to the door or something. And... Not gonna lie, it looks kind of boring. <laughs> but I am more of a combat-based uh, player, so yeah, it is going to be boring for me. And then another one is the, you know, like parkour. We had this before, but this time it has different skills and it's on a different place. We had this one on the dragon spine and it was kind of boring, honestly. <laughs> it was very boring. <laughs> uh, that was a while ago too, though. <laughs> It was such a 
It was such a boring game. But I think this time it's going to be a little fun because there's new mechanics uh, implanted on implanted. I can't think of words. I'm not. Oh, yeah, I got I got a degree in, in communications. Yeah, I definitely know how to speak. <laughs> yeah, anyways. Oh, yeah, this is the sailing event. You can do it on co-op or uh, single player. Um, I think, yeah, I forgot what this is, but yeah, anyways, it's just a sailing event. There's going to be also a combat event where you fight different enemies and then go to the next area, I think, or just this. Oh yeah, you will you will fight uh, a lot of enemies. Then you can obtain obtain the rewards once you beat them. Oh yeah, with three four stars, you can pick one of the these nine uh, four stars from Leeway. I'm going to be personally picking uh, Yao Yao because most of these characters are C six. Okay, so from Beidou to Yanfei, I I I have all of them at C six. Literally, <laughs> I have I have uh, Yunjin at C two, and I don't want to waste my Primo gems just to get one copy of Yao Yao. So I'm just gonna get Yao Yao for free, <laughs> even if it takes a little while to get her. But yeah, so I'm picking Yao Yao. I mean, it's up to you guys. Uh, who you pick but personally I'm picking Yao Yao so yeah that's gonna be awesome free four star nice but this is also very weird because we're getting an, ev uh, an another event but this time it's not lantern based it's going to be in Inazuma and first one is going to be Arataki Ito's uh, like beetle tournament not gonna lie though this looks kind of fun I mean I wish they had more mechanics than just you know pressing left and right but yeah, it could have been more fun, but I guess the t uh, timing is still everything. Oh yeah, and this one, the one uh, combat event that you get to uh, fight as Traveler, physical Traveler actually, and then yeah, you need to uh, time your uh, blocks to do a parry and then beat the enemies. I found it fun a little bit. Oh, and oh yeah, we're getting new two new skins. First one is going to be Ayaka, who's not free, so yeah. You're, you're, you're allowed to buy her skin at the shop. It has a discount at 3.4. The other skin that we're getting is Lisa. And honestly, she, she looks fucking awesome, bro. What? It looks amazing. Bro, bro. <laughs> I might, I might fucking use Lisa. <laughs> I mean, she's, she's good now uh, that Dendro is out. So I might fucking consider using her. Oh god, look at that skin. Oh. Oh yes, please take me home. <laughs> oh yeah, so yeah, this is going to be another combat event. Uh yeah, there's going to be multiple rounds. Yeah, it's going to be fun for me. Yeah, it's gonna be fun. You can also use trial characters, so yeah, that's gonna be fun. There's gonna be new update on TCG. Two new characters are coming out, which is Beto and Klee. And then there's going to be... I forgot. I think it's it's another mode where you get to fight with special effects. Like for this one, uh, you can uh, skip the elemental dice roll and then get instantly get 8 Omni Elemental Dice, which is gonna be nuts. Yeah, I guess that's about it. Also, new album. New uh, Genshin album is gonna be out. But honestly, I don't... I don't really care that much, but it's still cool, it's still cool, but yeah. Anyways, that's it for the 3.4 updates. This is just a condensed, you know, just to give you guys a little bit of info on what's coming in 3.4. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you all in the next video. Peace. Bye.